I'm back, Leo. Thank y'all for coming back. <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and do the chakras first, okay? So we got root chakra, okay? Base of the spine, an activity that makes one more aware of the body, survival basic. So root chakra, blocked, okay? Feeling stuck and sluggish, stress due to over-reliance on external circumstances, your environment, okay? We're in about what's going on. Persistent financial problems, feeling that you have been abandoned by your parents, constantly getting by or getting or going without, hatred and anger towards your body and others, feel you are not good enough the way you are, open, have a strong connection with your family, have friends that are like family to you, feel wanted and loved, feel content with your body, you're confident with money. Okay. Uh, hold on, Leo, Leo. Trying to get situated. Always have enough for what you need and want. Feel safe and earth, on earth and on your path. Affirmations to say to yourself. I am safe. I am safe on earth. I am safe on my path. That's a great thing, right? Uh, okay, what did I do? What did I do? What did I do? I missed it one, y'all. Yeah. Hold on one minute. I'm back. Sorry about that. Sacral chakra. Um, okay. Between the navel and bottom of sterum governs our instincts, self-esteem, gut, body, heat, and personal power. Color orange, element water, position below belly, body from head to the toe, physical center. Objective, sexuality, the natural, the nature of your relationships. Freedom from guilt, pleasure, sensation, creativity, and the joys in life. I was just thinking about that movie Carrie when the mom didn't want to have sex and told her it was dirty. Her sacred shock was blocked. Block. Difficult allowing yourself to become emotionally and sexually intimate. The belief that sex is bad, that it can hurt you, or you feel you have to be sexy to be loved. Feelings of abuse, hurt, and confusion. Distress that you can be loved for being you. You can't be loved for being you. Okay. A slugger, slugger, struggle towards a healthy self-image. A strong string at unsuccessful toxic relationships. Okay. When it's open, strong sense of your sexuality and recognize it has one of your most powerful creative energies. It's one of your most powerful creative energies. You create healthy sexual experiences with others that honor you. You enjoy pleasures in many different ways in love. When you love yourself, people love you. You are creative in all your endeavors, assuming that they love themselves. An affirmation to say, I am connected to my community. I am connected to my family. My sensual sexuality serves as a fuel to my creative endeavors. Boom. Okay. Solar plexus. Okay. Uh, city of Jewels, located in the upper belly at the diaphragm, it acts as the center of personal power. This chakra governs personalities, ego, identity, as well as personal freedom, choice, and authenticity. Cold color yellow, element fire, position above the navel, two inches below the breastbone. Uh, objective: relations, relationship with yourself, personal power, self-esteem self-worth and freedom from shame when blocked feeling powerless or victimized giving you giving your power away to others as you feel this is necessary to keep peace in relationships difficulty taking action on your dreams due to low self-esteem stomach pains and anxiety when it's open you have a strong sense of your own power and how to use it in healthy ways. Admire, admire others with power and influence and choose to emulate people who are. That's what I do about them big ass, big ass, tree now. Want to use your power and influence for, influ, influence for good in the world. Trust your intuition and inner guidance. Don't feel needed, need in other, don't feel need in other people's confirmation and validation affirmation to say i trust my intuition and guidance and follow it wherever 
wherever it leads me without question and hesitation. Okay? Great thing to say, right? Heart chakra. Okay? Color green. Love and spirituality. Compassion. Emotional zone. Masculine and feminine of the self. And forgiveness. Color green. Emotional element air position center of chest objective love and spirituality compassion emotional zone masculine and feminine of self and forgiveness love means for others and self-love self-acceptance when it's blocked fear of commitment and feeling like you have to please others to be loved hurt from past relationships and now feel like you have to guard yourself against being hurt Trouble with giving and receiving love and being compassionate. The need to hold grudges. Heart disease, as asthma and allergies. Open. Are comfortable in relationship. Give and receive love easily. Feel a heartfelt sense of gratitude for how wonderful your life is. Appreciate others and feel compassion for yourself and others without feeling sorry for anyone. Love yourself unconditionally. An affirmation to say, I am a divine expression of in unconditional love. I truly love myself. Love is all that I am and ever will be. Unconditional love of source is my birthright. That's wonderful, huh? Throat chakra. What time is it? Okay. Uh, your voice. Okay, color blue, element sound, position, hollow of the throat. Objective, your communication center. Your voice, your creative, your creativity, self-expression, speaking your truth, coming from the center of your willpower, listening and being heard. When it's blocked, your fear of speaking, fear of speaking up and saying what you want to say or feel, feeling inclined to go along with others so you don't upset anyone. Frustration, frustration because you don't feel that other people hear what you have to say. Sore throats are feeling like your throat is blocked. When throat is open, you are comf you are comf comfortable speaking your truth. You ex uh, expect others to listen to you. Feel and you feel like they are. Feel that you are heard and honored for your truth, knowing that you alone are responsible for your expressing yourself in an open and honest way. An affirmation to say, I speak my truth freely and openly, being honest with myself and others. I am safe to express myself truly. My honesty attracts what I deserve on my path or desire. Okay? Your third eye brow chakra. Located on the forehead between the eyebrows is represented by a violet lotus with two petals, means to perceive and command. Color indigo, element light, position between the eyebrows. Objective, responsible for psychic abilities such as intuition as well as your sense of purpose in life. Self-reflection, visualization, discernment, and trust of your own intuition. When it's blocked, a struggle to find meaning in life and often ask yourself, why am I here? Disconnect from your your intuition, difficult making decisions, feeling lost when it comes to your spiritual purpose and path in life, frustration that there is something wrong or out of alignment, headaches and tension in your brow area. When it's open, trust and act with confidence, have a strong sense of your own inner truth and listen to and follow it as it guards you on your life path, inner wisdom and clarity on your path. Strong connection with celestial love. An affirmation to say, I am connected with celestial love that runs through my vessel in life. I trust my inner wisdom and have total clarity on my path. Okay, celestial, that's everybody. Okay, crown chakra. Seven chakra, top of the chakra ladder, crown of the head. Unite in selfless realization that everything is connected at the foundational level color violet element thought position top of the head uh, this is the connection uh, objective this is the connection between you and the divine it is res responsible for spirituality belief system revelation divine consciousness and enlightenment your brain functions and center central nervous system 
are controlled by the crown when it's blocked loneliness insignificancy and aimlessness a strong attachment to material possessions and achievements and define yourself according to them and a disconnect from the spiritual side of life a lack of connection of, of or guidance from a higher power feeling unworthy of spiritual help and anger that your higher power has abandoned you migraines and tension headaches when it's open feel connected to a higher power and sense that you are being watched over and cared for know you deserve immense blessings feel immense gratitude for the universal love and appreciation you feel towards yourself and others connect to source and the mother earth okay affirmation to say to yourself i am transmuting anything that doesn't serve my highest purpose and my path today okay those are the chakras y'all hold on hey y'all we're going to talk about dr savior and electrical foods but i had no idea about how the brain is electric how everything is working in the world through the body so he says about an alkaline diet uh why we need that he says um do a plant-based diet in order to keep the electricity flowing through your brain, through your body. And it says, re it rejuvenates your cells by eliminating toxic waste through alkalining your body. So the body won't store mucus that causes all diseases. That's the, that uh, COVID is supposed to be, right? So alkaline water. Uh, like I tell you, I just made that water. I'm cleaning it the best I can. I don't know if I turn it alkaline or not. But uh, I feel like it's cleaner. The kale, dandelions, kalilo, he says no dairy products, but no potatoes, corn, except them little red potatoes. He said those are good. Tofu, any white rice, pasta, uh, bread, or wheat bread, sugar, table salt, that's white. Um, microwaves for that radiation. And make sure if you're taking chemo or radiation, you uh, take a spiritual bath, clean all that radiation out of you each time you do it. You do it. But research on yourself, you don't. Uh, well, just each time you do it, I'm not going to say nothing amiss of anybody. But TV dinners, canned and box foods, and all hybrid foods. If it don't have seeds in it, it's hybrid. Okay, everything's supposed to have seeds in it. Okay, they didn't do the grapes and made it and, and helped us out by not putting the seed in it so we could eat. That's a lie. Those are hybrid foods. It has no nutrients in it at all. Okay. Then the next thing is dopamine. Okay, that's in our brain and... Dopamine gets affected by too much internet, TV, phone, gambling, drinking, smoking, people, sexing, food, uh, the wrong foods, radio, and too much food. Uh, that's why you fast, okay? The music is on the wrong frequency, wrong vibration, messing with our mind, the dopamine in our head. A guy suggests just drink good alkaline water and just sit, just be. Enjoy Mother Nature. You know, don't do anything. No, eat. Don't do anything for however long you could take it. You know, learn how to be quiet again. And please teach your kids that. Okay? And uh, maybe write. Bring a pencil and a paper along and ideas that come along. <clears throat> you know, that's when you're probably your um, higher self and your Akashi record is going to kick in. So, uh, bad for us. Loss of pleasure, motivation, empathy, goals, focus. Heavy metals in there, so look what they pleasure in themselves by anything. People pleasure themselves by sticking themselves or playing, hitting their heart and dying and come back to life. And all I got to do with dopamine, we're too busy, they got too much activities for us. All them sex dolls, and you can't set you ain't satisfied by the mate you got. You got to go off and get other mates, and you're still not satisfied. That's that dopamine, y'all. Then you got motivation, empathy, all of that. You know, people on the internet they could care less about what's happening with people on the internet and in, and in real life you know no motivation to go and do anything no goals no focus don't even know why you're here you know not trying to find out could care less pleasuring yourself all wrong so to boost it get enough sleep for you everybody's sleep pattern is different okay find out yours so probiotics we'll read more about probiotics and mucolina all this can help. Uh, Perinas, a type of tropical bean, said it come in a powder form as well. I'm going to try to find that. Needed for brain to produce dopamine, okay? And I'm pretty sure some of these plants we got also good for Parkinson's disease, 
ginkgo biloba, mental performance, brain mood function, perculum, or oregano oil, magnesium, green tea, vitamin D, fish oil, caffeine, gin, ginger, barber, 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 <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> barberin, give me some of my water, hold on y'all. Okay, I'm back. So copper um, deficiency. That's the old age, right? <clears throat> they convinced us of being sickly while you're getting older, which is lies. So no copper in the food, so what? In the stores, there's nothing, no nutrients in that food. And I was, you know, I said about <clears throat> who made the stores. Ask what kind of questions, y'all, and find it out. It's control. So they can have make our food in the laboratory, so they take all that out. So, of course, your bones going to be brittle, your hair gray, and falling out, you have pain, your skin all messed up, skin tags and brown marks, <clears throat> you know what I'm saying, moles, vision loss, weakness, fatigue, sickness, often memory, learning, difficult walking, <clears throat> along with iron enables the, the body to form Red blood cells maintains healthy bones, blood vessels, nerves, immune function, iron absorption, prevents cardiovascular disease, osteoporosis, pale skin, gray hair, sensitive to cold. Okay, and if you not getting on a plant based diet, there are meats, you know, but I would do that at least once or twice a month or a week or something, according to what you need, how your body is. Beef, liver, oysters, lobsters, lamb, liver, squid, dark chocolate, oats, almonds, sesame seeds, cashew nuts, sunflower seeds, the whole sunflower, y'all. It's great. I make a tea out of it. Y'all see it on my, uh, our ancestors, ancient products, a lot of stuff I show. Even mushrooms, okay? Side effects of too much of it. I had an experience of that because I wear it around my neck. And I made uh, my herbs and stuff that had a lot of copper in it, so I seen the black stool, okay? Na nausea, vomiting, it didn't get that bad. Diarrhea, uh, stomach pain, headaches, difficult breathing, irregular heartbeat, coma, could die. Yellow skin, low blood, kidney and liver. Remember, too much of anything is good for you, so you got to know how much for you. That takes focus on yourself now, okay? We're going to do zinc right quick. And then we're going to go to probiotics. So zinc. Okay. Deficiency. You're sick a lot. Chronic allergies. So they took that out too. Uh, leaky gut. Food allergies. Thyroid problems. Adrenal fatigue. Not absorbing food well. Diarrhea. Loose stools. Irregular bowel syndrome. Gas. Bloating. Thinning hair. Inflammatory skin issues. So that bloating and... Uh, what is it? Oh, shoot. I forgot what I was going to say. Anyway. Uh, acne, eczema, dermati dermatitis, cirrhosis causes, causes high emotional stress. Your body uses up too much of your zinc to heal and repair. So, you got to make sure it's in the food. So, they count on we don't. The body to repair the brain, to repair the skin, to repair your zinc is even critical for protein synthesis and utilization in your body okay uh, this reasons why you could lose your zinc loss in family stress job what's going on today if you worried about that stop worrying not enough sleep over exercise whatever that means three or let's marathon runners cross athletes pregnancy or breastfeeding aging women and men may not absorb zinc good, so we have to watch it as we get older. Foods to eat, salt, uh, pumpkin seeds, uh, oysters, grass-fed beef, sprouted nuts, seeds, chickpeas, chick seeds, flexi seeds, almonds, peas, probiotics, kefir, sauerkraut, increased absorption and digestion of zinc. Okay, so we're going to read probiotics, y'all. So probiotics, it is a good bacteria, goes to work for your digestive system, supports immune system, bowel support, and maintains intestinal health, help loosens minor abdominal discomfort and occasional bloating, 
help prevent occasional diarrhea, meaning of live microorganism, which when administered in adequate amounts confirm a health benefit on the post, provide numerous health benefits. Foods found yogurt, kefir, ferment, milk, drink with sour taste, yeast, and bacteria. So, you know, we don't have to use dairy products. You know what I'm saying? Dr. Sabre did have said that also for the slime and the mucus in it. Okay? And how they kill it. Take it from the animals. Okay? Help support your bio, microbiome collective genomes of microbiomes composed of bacteria, bacteria, of, uh, bacterial feeds, feeds, whatever. Y'all see. Fungi, protozoa, and viruses that live inside and on the human body, we have 10 times as many bio, microbial cells as human cells, disease, diabetes, rheumatoid arthritis, kefir fermented food with the cons consistency to yogurt made from dairy milk and non-dairy also boosts your immune system. All this is gonna take time, but it's good we're gonna be on that path. Um, immune system aids in digestive problems, in, improves bone health, and may even combat cancer. Okay. A microbiome, muscular dystrophy, multi cirrhosis, and fibromyalgia are associated with dysfunction in the microbiome. This is essential for human development, immunity, and nutrition. Uh, they are uh, bad invaders, bacteria, probiotics, alive bacteria, yeast that are good for you. Helps keeping your gut healthy, balance your good and bad bacteria. So that means probiotics helps people who can't digest lactose, the sugar, and milk. Okay. Um, bio bacteria, bio female bacteria can help ease the symptoms of irritable bowel syndrome, IBS and other conditions, whatever that word is, yeast problems help fight diarrhea and other digestive problems. What do we do? Probiotics help send food through your gut by affecting nerves that control gut movement, irritable bowel syndrome, inflammatory bowel disease, IBD, infectious diarrhea caused by viruses, bacteria. What, what to do? Uh, with parasites, diarrhea caused by an antibiotic, biotics, other things it helps with. Okay, it helps with back of parasites, y'all. Skin conditions like ex eczema, ex eczema, urine, and vagina odor help help preventing allergies and colds, or help. Ask the herbal doctor, y'all. Side effects: upset stomach, diarrhea, gas, and bloating. First couple of days, allergic reactions. Stop taking ask doctor research better. You know, everything in moderation. Probiotics fights off bad bacteria when have too much. No two persons have the same microbial cells. Twins also. Okay. In order for microbial to be called probiotic, it must have several characteristics. Being able to be isolated from a human survival in your intestinal after indigest ingestion being eaten, having a proven benefit to you, be safe, consume. They live mostly in your large intestines. Good. You have several locations in your body that host good bi microbes. These are in contact with the outside world and include gut, mouth, vagina, urinary tract, skin, and lungs. Okay. This all happens naturally in your body all the time. You don't actually need to take probiotic supplements to make it happen. Good bacteria is just a natural part of your body. Eating a well-balanced diet, rich in fiber, every day helps to keep the number of good bacteria at proper levels. By doing this, it fights inflammation, digestive food, bad bacteria, won't get out of control and make you sick. Create, create vitamins, supports, helps cells that line your gut to prevent bad bacteria that you may have consumed through food or drinks unhealthy stuff from entering your your blood or too much of stuff breaking down absorbed medications whatever that word is in infants helps too foods good yogurt pickles 
whatever them in fermented tea or kefir dairy drink for extra probiotics check labels for uh live and active cultures buttermilk sourdough bread cottage cheese tempered fermented sauerkraut kef kimchi miso soup don't add too much capsules or pills powders or liquids so them capsules please chew them up i mean crush them before you use them because they don't they just sit there sometimes especially the one for calcium um mother nature edible plants natural that mother nature edible plants for probiotics also human milk breastfeeding and your children is more healthier because they're human not an animal plants with fiber in them hemp flexi whatever them is hip hip hibiscus a, a gave i like that a gave syrup it's really good indian hemp nettles okay all this can help so thank you leo leo hope i'm helping you please if anything advice y'all have for me i really appreciate it give me a comment how y'all think about everything and y'all stay healthy and on our healing journey and love others okay please because we're gonna need each other believe me we are don't get stuck on the wall i'll tell y'all what that is in another video as soon as i research more if y'all know more y'all let me know i right, love y'all you have a great day like subscribe share and comment okay until next time y'all Bye. Love y'all.